asked David, you guys know David, the like the goat, literally the goat, to find me a bunch of clips from old Hearthstone Pro games to see if I could find the winning line that they took to win the game. Um, that is pretty much the play. And I believe what he says here is you will have about the same amount of time that the player spent on their turn. So that seems to be the case. Um, you're getting one max. Hopefully this idea is good because if this idea is good, I will be uh, I'll be a big fan. I just don't know how long these are. So we'll, we'll see what this is. I have no idea what games he picked. I have no idea what games he's picked. So I'm really excited to see this. Uh, I guess we'll just try this out. I also turned the volume for you guys. All right. Can you find the pro play? Video starts easy, but gets harder with each play. At least I think so. You will have about the same amount of time the player spent on their turn. Okay. All right. First, let me understand what metagame this is then. Hold on. So this is Mean Streets of Gaddison. We know Blackrock Mountain's up. We know All Gods came out. Uh, Sunkeeper Tarim came up in Ungoro. So this is probably Ungoro. Okay. Oh, shit. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. I didn't see the bar at the top. That's my bad. That's my bad. Why do you tell me to pause? Oh, fuck. Um, this is too fast, dude. Um, Devolve. Think for below. Jinyu water beater. Oh, my no, God. No, no. Oh, oh you did it. Oh. Okay. Hold on a second. <laughs> Hold on a second. In current Hearthstone, actually, they made this change that it will change minions if you evolve or devolve something. It no longer transforms to the same thing, which is why I was like, oh, if you devolve this, we're free. <laughs> oh, I guess. Story of the event. Oh, it's a good game, JJ. We're done here. There was no winning play. Okay. Yeah, I got to go fast. I got to go fast. He's backing it up with damage. But still, just that one being taken off. Ball carrier into what? To Probably Kazak is here. Okay. He's so ahead on board that it doesn't matter. I mean, you're probably hitting Kazakis. You're looking for a way not to die. Almost guaranteed. So it's Kazakis, one mana potion, hope you get armored. That's the line. That's the only line. Kazakis, one mana potion, hope you get the armor. That's the only line you can take here. You, you, you can't kill him. Comes down, and you're assuming he has Leroy in hand. And, you know, I imagine we are going to see. There we go. One mana potion. No doubt about it. And the armor gain is an option. I imagine that was a snap pick. I'm in. Why the hell not at this point? Four I'm back. Random demon. Oh, my God. The Jaraxxus high roll potential, I imagine. Oh, oh my God. Oh, my God. And he got Jaraxxus. Oh, oh, so he won the game no matter what there. Okay. <sighs> maybe uh, thinking that this is ultimate infestation, it may play around. Oh, my God. What? Talon Priest. Um, um, does he have lethal? Oh my fucking God, dude. I don't know. I don't know. Lyra into a bunch of nonsense. It's like the only place my brain goes, right? Oh shit. I have no idea. It could be a number of things though. Like it could very trade into what the Lyra. And I think in some instances, this could even be like a Jade idol. I don't remember what that card does. There's, there's quite a few things oh that fuck that is an insane play i like how i went for random oh, bullshit go gosh. where he was actually hard thinking of the line wow. dude he's so much better than me i did not see that and i did not that either. Is quite even the casters were like i didn't see that and maybe that was the plan all along dude can we go back hold on what the hell dude look at where this turn started three five on board Four, four, five, six, eight, two, plus the talent priest, and look where it ended. In the, all along, that was crazy. Oh, oh this is a classic rain ad play. Okay, I've seen this before though. <laughs> look it up. The salt is real. Okay, I had rain ad on for that one. That's probably good. Actually, it's kind of fun to see rain ed when yeah. he's getting 
Oh, you, okay, what did he do last time? He, he, he kill commands. No, he plays the Tundra Rhino. Oh, here, here we go. I'm sure oh, man. He, he oh, kill nice. commands he his. Knows he knows that he's dead. Like, even to Fireball. You Tundra Rhino. Deal 70 damage you turn. kill command your 7 2. He had the win. Almost. Your Tundra Rhino plus the, the, the two like an iron things that summon off that is 9 damage plus Liok is 11 plus one this one is 5 and then. Because if he has, if he you has hear a power, the, no, you buzzard, you buzzard is lethal. Buzzard, Tundra Rhino, you kill command your Savannah Hyman, and everything goes face. And then like maybe damage. aim for it. And tracking with, actually with two flares and a tracking. Am I missing something? Try to fist for some I mean, that's 17 exact, right? But I don't kill command your dude, you get six damage. He probably made sacrifices. You put the Tundra Rhino, you get three, that's nine. Plus Liak is 11, 14, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Needle somehow deal five damage out of five mana. Doesn't matter what your next draw. I don't know what. Did David show me his draws for a reason? Oh, he's going for it. Don't test Boris too, but it doesn't matter. Oh, kill command on his That's own. David trying to it's just switch me up here with the How with the draws. Oh yeah. Uh, I don't think so. I I can't count. Easiest lethal of my life. Let's go. Oh, it's exact wow. lethal. That's but I, to be fair, I've seen that play before. I don't know about oh you guys chat. Oh my chat. god, I'm, I'm gonna clap to that one. That was yeah, pretty that nasty. Was, that was, That's why man. he's the goat. He executed beautifully. Oh no, because they wouldn't have enough mana to Deathwing. So Coon would do it. So Coon oh would do it. my god, excuse me. Charge Devil Sword, Branching Paths, and Jade Blossom. He has two Barnabases on board. This is a lethal that my tiny brain could not think of. Is it? No, I was going to say, is it ever just like copy the Void Lord here? Deathwing seems wrong. There's no way you're dealing damage this turn as far as I can tell. So I'm thinking you like, you copy the Void Lord, you cube it. And then you, you, you copy, use the other Faceless Corruptor to copy the cube. I don't know what. Oh uh, God! What does he do? Was I right? Double faceless that cube. So now you have five minions on board. It's it's. Leroy and this. Wait, is this lethal? Trades the Leroy. Six, which is He's five two board. into the Void Lord. He's done it! By golly! Uh, he just killed both his charging. He has another one. <laughs> He's got oh, it. the charge devil sword actually is relevant. But how does he clear the board? Golly, he's done it. What am I? Oh, Deathwing! Uh -oh. oh my, dude! You could give me, you could probably give me three hours, and I wouldn't be able to get that. He doesn't get these like three hours minimum, and I wouldn't be able to get that. There is so an but well played for sure. That's a that's there a crazy so ass lethal. That's lethal, I'm assuming, right? Oh, the fist bump comes out! Holy moly. He got it! The quest ruin takes the victory. There's no shot I would have gone that. There's absolutely no way. Dog's turn. Hadronox is empty. Okay. <sighs> I mean, this is the Defile Andy turn. The question is, can I actually figure out the Defile turn? I don't think this is lethal, but he's probably going for the full clear here. And you he, he definitely want to kill the Hadronox first. So it, it's almost like this Hadronox goes into this. And then you have a three, four. You need a two. So the two, what? Bumps into one of the Tar Creepers. So then you have a two, three. So this bumps into here. This bumps into here. And then you Defile the board. You have a two, three, you don't have a four. So you need to use one of the Voilerts to bump into one of the, the the five health minions. You deal with everything but the Voiler, but then you can hear a power after. Yeah, okay. I'm thinking this, this. Hold on, let me go through my play here. This is what I would have done. This is, I know there's more, there's, there's not enough time, but I'm just going to walk through just to see if I'm correct. Hadronox. Wait, you can't hit the Hadronox into the three, four. Okay, hold on. I'm fucking stupid. You hero power into the, th there's no way I would have gotten this in time. There's no way. You hero power this, so it's at one life. This goes into a, a, a Tar Creeper to set up for three life. Because you have a two. This bumps in for the four. You have four. 
You have a five, you have a six. You could even bump this in two if you really want to just fully clear the board. Yeah, let's see what he does. That's my play. Come on, you want to make sure the Hadronox dies first, though, before any of the top minions spawn. So I, I think you always hero power hero the, the Hadronox, the right? First. He trades into the, oh, the, wow. the Drake. And there's the six. There was already a seven, so he'll also summon yeah. Void Lord from his side of the board. Okay, let's yeah, have the hero power right afterwards, of course. Yeah, yeah. Wow, this is weird. Is there a cap on the number of defiles that happen? I must be 20. Now. This is a full clear for sure, though, right? Like, it's just yeah, Defile I, I Andrew? Holy shit. It, it's crazy looking how different Hearthstone is. Oh, wow. Hydronox effect went off on Ryu's side. Like, look at. Yep. Oh, oh my god! god. The Rin is back! Dog's the nuts. All right, what else we got? You're taking time off, you're back? Yeah, I took a week off. Oh, gosh. The Violet Teacher build. Neither player. Wait, we're doing a mulligan here, David? Oh, fuck. This is even harder. What's the matchup here? Looks like Jade. Jade Death Knight from what? Knights of the Frozen Throne? This is the world championship for the year of the mammoth. So Death Knight wasn't there yet. As far as I'm concerned, the last expansion was what? No, this is year of the mammoth. So this is on Goro. Oh my God. You keep you keep one ultimate infestation from Frozen side and from Tom. That's all I know. Probably the Oaken Summons as well. I'd keep ultimate infestation and Oaken Summons for Tom and only one ultimate infestation for Frozen. Maybe both, maybe. Oh, wants to look at this. Oh, wow. Oh, interesting. That what? is not something I expected to see. Tom keeps ultimate infestation. He finds wild growth. He you keep ultimate awesome. infestation in this because you know your, your whole deck is based off ramp. Will that pay off? Ultimate infestation. I'm in. Like so many times before. Draws Tom a huge hand. Another infestation. Tom has the opportunity to take lots of advantageous trades. Okay. And with the arcane tower in his hand, infestation. Yeah, he won because of it. Two. Yeah. So the Is he stupid? Just play Rito, shake my head. Doesn't have these arcane tyrants for the swings. And Tom with the. You're so right, dude. Campus. You're so right, Rito. Infestation is paying off in spades. Fifteen. Yeah, yeah, and I'm winning it because of it. All right, chat, was that fun? Did you guys have fun? This was like a test trial to see if this is worth doing more of. Too late. Frozen picks up a hand of cards, but Tom has a board full of giant minions. This is looking like it's going to be over soon. Oh my God, look at this. Like, they're going to go down to four cards and two cards. Victory is his. Tom 60229 is the 2017 Hearthstone World Champion. It's wild. We have a new member in the Hall of Champions. Man, every time I watch one of these, I just feel like I suck. 